Welcome back guys. We are playing Metro Exodus 2035 and uh, oh we see the kilometers this engine has run it's 2718. <laughs> so we are uh, in the last video our game I think it crashed because uh, our player went out of the map so this time again we're gonna see if we can continue from the point and see how the story goes and I think uh, that our thing Yama is uh, just a lie the final destination of our long journey yeah Direct it's just a lie the looks of it completely dissolved if it was maintained by some authority then there was some you know development but I didn't saw any development at all Back to the safe zone. So in the last video my player went there. I don't know why. Because I got stuck over here. So why is this area still ready to? Right. No, no, I wasn't far. This is a bad place. Now we shouldn't have come here. Really? Okay, so where's my welcoming committee and red carpet? I don't get this. Oh, see? Nobody home. How about we go back? Huh? Baby? Look! <laughs> Identify yourself. Colonel Miller, here to report to the Minister of Defense. And where are your people, Colonel? With the train. It's dangerous outside. Contact them and tell them to take the train into the main airlock for decontamination. Welcome to the Ark, Colonel. Proceed through the tunnel and take the elevator. You'll be met inside. I don't think, you know, this is a good place. You see the inside? Yeah, the place is creepy. Why is it so deserted here? No gun placements, no patrols. Yeah. Not even lookouts. Why would they need any of that? A nuclear war and couldn't take it out. Are you not, Smuller? Can you see the walls? Can I shoot? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, let me out. Did you at least prepare a speech? 
Reporting to the minister is no joke. Ah, get off my case. I pulled an all nighter. <laughs> Don't you feel like you should say something to Artyom now? Yes. You were right, Artyom. And I was wrong. Thanks for not giving up. You're welcome. Comrade Minister, Commander of the Joint Special Operations Forces, Squadron of the City of Moscow, Colonel Miller, reporting. I would like to request that my people are provided with temporary quarters and supplies, as there are women and children among us. Still, our fighters are in top shape and ready for action. Women and this is children. looking bad, huh? <laughs> Good. Haven't had those in a while. Who are you? <laughs> The hell? I was leading them nicely. Wow. No is a badass, I guess. Okay, that's fucked up. So the arc is really not a not the arc. <laughs> Everyone is fine. So far. So far? I I demand a, a meeting with the Minister of Defense now. Do not worry. Everything will be just fine. And even better. The minister and the chief himself are expecting you for dinner. Dinner? What the hell? Are you fucking mocking me? Shut up! The doctor is talking. All here, Colonel. All here. We are the government you people deserve. Don't you dare, you fuck! You're just... You're just fucking cannibals! Go. Oh. Calm down. They Look eat human. like this. And believe me, nobody likes that bitter taste. The girl will have to wait, though. We must run the tests first. I don't like that call for Untie hers. my hands, you motherfucker! And I'll shove those tests so far up your ass, you'll be spitting Watch them. your tone, young lady. Do as that young man does. He woke up long ago, but quietly listens to wise people talk. Uh, you fucker! Let me... let me go! So, Colonel, now you will pick up the radio and tell the rest of your people and the train to come here. If you don't want her to suffer for a really long time before she is served. Do you understand? And here I was hoping for an intelligent conversation for a change. Alas. That's not a problem, though, since this nice young man will surely do it instead. He won't dare be contradictory once we're done with you. Well, nice meeting you and all. Yakov, you may start. I'll get you even after I'm dead. That may well happen, Colonel. I could choke on you or something. In the meantime, I'll you excuse beast. myself. Come here, I'll rip you all apart. Every last one of you should have done that before the war. Well, get to 
Now we'll be fooled again. Good. Yeah, you fucker. Take all the few enemies in danger. So where am I going? This way, right? No. Should I kill you right now? We can hope to find Anna. Still, the complex is huge, and we have ten minutes at the most. So we'll have to split up. Son, I think you Miller will die. Time, the generator hall and the storage. Idiot, you come with me to the command center. Artyom, you take the barracks and the sick bay. She must be in the sick bay because. That fucker said that uh, they'll be running some tests on me. Okay, if it's my floor. Let's rock and roll. Nothing else? Okay. So what the thing, what the fuck is happening? So 
So where am I going? It's like I'm trapped here and I'm not able to do anything. Uh, let's see your arrow. It points us here, but this thing hasn't opened yet. Do we need anything? <laughs> I killed myself. Open. What the fuck is happening? Okay, this is the thing. Fucker. It was like I'm mean into bullets. Oh man, they are eating humans. But, mm, this is what Arca is all about. Yep. Fuck off. Okay. Be fuck. Come. Fucking sick bastards. You're not taking me, man. I'm not your meat.
So many bullets, but I can't pick any. Really? Come on, come on, come on. What the F? So why was this room available to us? To go there? Let's go, let's go. I cannot go that way, no worries. I can go this way. Why did you shoot them? What the fuck? But there was me. Me, you see. That's me! What the fuck? Who shot me from there? I said this is a very good fight actually. I'm getting all the ammunition.
Okay, that worked. You fucker. Why are you shooting me from there? I think we are near Rana. Fuck you. He's down. He's down for sure. What the fuck? Damn, they killed him. Uh, dead. So what? This motherfucker took most of our gun. Let's get as many possible. Because we need the bullets for sure. <coughs> So where are we going now? Let me see how much, yeah. That's good.
I was able to see something else as well. Let's see. Um, so we got something for this as well. Yeah, we can do that. I don't need. That's it. They are fucking freaks, you know. I think uh, this is where Hana must be. After the storm, maybe? Okay, there she is. Hey, Anna. Artyom, I knew! Behind you! You the fuck? It is always one like you, a hero. You're not saving anyone, just like the others. So just freeze! Yes, yes! Then Let just, him just go. don't kill me! Now. Uh, remember what I told you! There was an explosion! Enough chatter! <laughs> there was a what? Are you alright, Artyom? Thank God. You're a brave girl. Let's report to the Colonel. Can I get your gear? It's me. Father, are you okay? Where are you? In the sick bay. Artyom found me. Oh, thank God. Well done, Artyom. Where do they go now? There's an elevator straight down the corridor. It goes right to the command center. Let's go. Not too fast, though. I need to catch my breath a bit. You okay? Yes, with his damn fanatics. <sighs> Are you okay, babe? Come on. But no, it appears there was still space for growth. We could have gotten killed there. We almost got eaten. <coughs> that bastard. Unbelievable. To think he used to be a doctor. Don't matter. We'll see what happens now. We did survive him, after all. Oh. 
eating people for 20 years. Could you imagine that? I'm sorry. I got carried away like a greenhorn recruit. The minister was going to see me. And conceit made me go to place. I even saluted those ghouls. Some fucking ark. These monsters have it made. <coughs> like the watchers in Moscow. Those keep people underground with their deceit. These. All right, but what do we do I'll now? Damned if I know. No idea. Have you found anything, idiot? Their defense sites, HQs. All the information is outdated. All links are long gone. Still, the ones that light up worked for at least a few years after the war. What's down there? It's Caspian One, a comm center. There's one more just like that in Novosibirsk. <laughs> Are you going to drive us to some other now? One moment. I'll finish breaking everything here. Come on, come on. Okay, all done. It really did. My concern is what if next time it doesn't? You're right, of course. But you intend to live forever? <laughs> of course. Ah! All the more reason to survive and spend my time with what is allowed to me. Is that guy over there? I've grown attached to him. Where is Miller? Ah. So where is Sam? The hell? What was they shooting me? Come on. Ah, come on, Nana. I almost shot your arm. That's it. You're blocking my view.
<laughs> bon, you guys, bon. Looks like this place is completely over. Time to go find the real government bunker, I guess. Yeah. From Hansa. I believed that Moscow was controlled by the HQ, that we were under occupation, that we were still in war, that there were generals here giving orders. What an idiot, Suka! I will repeat my question. What do we do now? Could we go back to Moscow? Tell them the truth about the war. The government. They'll shoot us on approach. And even if we do break through, what can we do against Hansa? Who'd believe us with no proof? <laughs> what about going back to Volga? We could live there. What do we do about the locals? They weren't exactly happy to see us there. Do we kill them all? Is anybody here up for that? Back in Moscow, Artyom had been dreaming of finding a habitable place and building a colony there. Isn't it time we got to it? The idea is good. But how do we find the place? Just keep traveling? The Aurora needs an overhaul. <coughs> what do we do if it breaks down? Satellites. What satellites? You want to leave the fucking planet? <laughs> There's a satellite communication center on the Caspian Sea. It survived the war. Oh. But <coughs> if we gain access to the data collected by the satellites... We won't have to travel randomly. <coughs> Radiation level maps, even your regular satellite photos could really help us out here. That's an idea. What if there is something worse than cannibals there? <coughs> Could well be. But first, we're going to be really careful this time. And second, does anyone have any better ideas? I don't. Well, I guess we've got ourselves a new plan. Artyom, shall we look for that place you wanted? Sound the horn, then. <coughs> Three months on the road, three months of constant trial. But after Yamantau, we are ready for anything fate can throw at us. Mere kilometers separate us from the Caspian One communication center. Will the maps within yield a spot free from radiation where we could finally settle in peace? I don't know, but what's left for us but hope? The desert is taking its toll. The crew suffers from heat and thirst, and the Aurora is not in her top form. We're out of coal and had to switch to burning available fuel. Old cross ties and twigs. I'm not speaking much because I'm really enjoying the story. Wow. Look at the beauty. And the booty. I'm not in love with this place. Is Nothing it but sand and heat. <laughs> I feel like shit here. It looks like a old uh, woman. Somehow, I don't like this welcome either. Let's go. They stopped in that village, though. Looks like somebody lives there. I see. How are the men doing? Just wanting to work 
Do a bat. Uh oh. Can we clear this one? No. That's why I need the water. Look for water and fuel. Artyom, come here. Yeah. Artyom, we have to learn who those men with the car are. They do look like regular bandits, but we can't take risks here. The car was headed for the village. Looks like they have a comms relay there, and it should hold some info, which is just what we need. <coughs> Move out as soon as you're ready. Crest, can your rail car pull the train? It might, but really slowly and not for too long. The engine is too weak for the weight and we don't job. have much diesel left. All clear. What are these? Looks like bombs to me. Clear. Come on, I want to go there. I've got something for you. Hello. Sit in a teary ammunition. Okay. I don't want these at the moment. What are you going out? Yeah. Look here then. This is something I finished just now. Well, I hollowed out a couple of T-Har bullets and filled them with explosive. Some explosive ammo right there. Oh yeah, I need well, to make... you can do it yourself. It's quite simple. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to clean your guns regularly. Yeah. Sand around. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let me see my guns. This is good. This one, this one is good. This one, this one is good. Everything is good now. What is this? Gatling machine gun. No, I don't want to replace that. Okay, guys, uh, I have to s make sure if there is any mode of communication in that footage so that i'm going to do in the next video <clears throat> till then take care bye bye guys have fun adios hey just wait okay there they are wait i'm coming with you i think i could use a little walk right now stopa you can hardly walk you'd better rest while it's not your shift well, Artyom, I really do feel kind of under the weather now. Maybe next time. You're right. Artyom and Demir are going out for a simple recon, not a fight. And <laughs> what if they get attacked? Then they'll retreat back to base where you and Sam cover them. 
So you should rest now. Yes. You're right, Katya. Yeah. How is Stepan doing? He's got a sunstroke. And he's dehydrated to boot. We should let him rest in a cool place. The boys are checking the station building now. We'll put him there once they're done. Oh, I hope they finish soon. Okay, guys. Bye-bye.